Welcome grade 6 to this math tutorial on percentages. Now percentage means out of 100 and it is always denoted by this sign. So whenever we have an amount followed by this sign, we will understand that we need to divide that number with 100. For example, if we look at this 10%, 10% simply means 10 divided by 100. We can further simplify this and write 1 by 10. Now, 1 by 10 can also be written as a decimal, which is this 0 will shift the decimal of the 1, one digit to the left. So it will become 0 0.1. Now, since we have converted the percentage into fraction and decimal, we can also go the other way around. For example, if you're provided with a fraction 1 by 4, we can multiply this with 100%. If we multiply with 100%, then if we further simplify, the percentage that we are going to end up getting is 25%. That means 1 by 4 simply means 25%. In the same way, if we look at 0 0.75, 0 0.75 multiplied with 100%. So now these two zeros will shift the decimal places two digits to the right. So it will become 75%. So we have learned how to convert percentages into fractions and decimals and the other way around. Now if you look at exercise 8a from your book, question number 1 asks us to com convert from percentages to fraction. Number 1D is 6 whole 3 by 5. Now if you convert this percentage into fraction, we will first convert the mixed number into a fraction. So this will become 33 by 5. Now 33 by 5 divided by 100. When we turn this division sign into multiplication sign, this number will become reciprocal. So it will become 33 by 5 into 1 by 100 which if we multiply the numerators and denominators, we will get 33 by 500. Number 2, we have been asked to convert the percentages into decimals. Number 2D, the number given is 33 whole 2 by 3 percent. Now this if we need to convert into decimals, then first we need to write the mixed number in a fraction form. So this can be written as 101 by 3. Now this divided by 100. So in the same way we will get the decimal value for this will be 0 0.337. Then if we look at number 3, they have asked us to convert from fractions to percentages. Number 3f is the mixed number 1 whole 6 by 25. Now in this case first we convert the mixed number into a fraction, so which will be 31 by 25, and this will be multiplied with 100%. So the resulting answer will be 124%. Question number 4, they have asked us to convert the decimals into percentages. Number 4F, the percentage given is 2.6. So 2.6 multiplied with 100%, will give us 260%. This decimal will shift two digits to the right. The next number over here is 0, so it will become 260.